Here's how you're gonna make two amazing thumbnails under 10 minutes. Ready? Start your clock. First things first is we need our picture. Now, unless you already have one saved in your computer, what you're gonna do is get your phone and instead of putting the timer, you're gonna use the camera. Once you have the video on, you're gonna do like three or four poses, hold it for like three seconds each, and then screenshot it. Then you can send it right into your computer. And in your computer, we're gonna open up a tool called Canva. It's an editing tool that helps you create YouTube thumbnails, TikTok videos, Instagram reels. You can do so much with this program. Canva does have a free program, but also a paid program. I am going to do my best to use some of the free features. The thumbnail I'm going to create is a work from home thumbnail. So let's get into it. Now, once you're in Canva, you're going to go to create design, then YouTube thumbnail. From here, it's gonna take you to this blank page. So once you've got your picture, you're just gonna import it into Canva and then go to uploads and look for the one that you want, select it and go in there. So here's the picture that I had taken. I'm gonna adjust this. Now I know I don't want this whole background in here, so we're gonna do edit image and background removal. Now if you see this little crown, that does mean that this is part of the paid program. And see, look how quick and easy it took away the background just in a few seconds. So I'm just gonna put myself over here. Now, next thing you wanna do, I am gonna show you first how to create your own background. So we're gonna go to elements. You can type in color, background and here it'll give you all the backgrounds that you can use again you see the crown it's part of the pros but there are a bunch of free ones that you can use now i want to do something a little more cool so because we are doing an at-home office i'm just gonna do home office and here you can use any of these and it'll put you in this type of office so you can scroll down and find something you like i actually like this one so i'm gonna select it and make it fit to the screen. Then I'm gonna send this back. So you're gonna hit the three dots, layer, and send back. That brings me to the front. So let's adjust this, put me to the side. Now I can move this over so I have more. And we can make it bigger this way. Okay, that doesn't look bad, but it does look a little fake. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna select the picture in the back. We're gonna edit. Then we're gonna go down and we're gonna hit the blur. From here, you can blur the background. This tool right here, you can select which part you wanna blur. If it's only just, let's say you just wanna blur this table part, then you can do that. But I wanna blur the whole image. So I'm gonna do that and then hit intensity and there. If you go all the way, you see how it goes here. So I'm not gonna do too much, but I want a little blur. And that's it. We go back and this is how it looks with it blurred and that actually looks really good now another feature that i would like to show you guys is how to and let me pull this down because you see if you go this down it cuts you off so that's like a crop tool as well but i want to be able to use everything all right, so I kind of want to make myself stand out a little more. I want to put like an outline on me. I'm going to edit image, then I'm going to go down, and I'm going to hit shadows. Now here, I can put an outline around myself. That's black. I don't like the color. It looks funky, so you can change the color here. I'm going to make it white. And now you can't really see it, so you can make it as big as you want or as small as you want. It's up to you. You can use this, you can do it as a glow, and you can change the color again. Just so I can show you, that's what it'll look like. Actually, that's not that bad. So we could do the glow like that, but let's just change it back to like a whitish color, darker. Just decided to keep it black and make the blur right here and it's it actually looks really good i i'm happy with it now you want to add some text to it so we are saying that we're going to do a work from home you can do your own text here or you can use one of these many templates that they have so there is a bunch of free ones i actually i saw this one i like this one because it kind of goes with the theme of the colors so you can adjust the size and you can edit the text. Work from, make the font smaller, okay. And then we'll edit this, we'll put home. 
and you can adjust it however you want play with it whatever you feel remember it's your youtube channel i'm actually really happy with this i mean you can adjust it a little more but this seems really good to me now once you're done with that one then you can go ahead and just share it and upload it to your YouTube thumbnail. Now I wanna show you another way. If you don't feel so creative and you don't wanna do something like this, you can use their actual templates and just adjust it. So let me show you that. All right, so we go back into Canva, go to create a design, YouTube thumbnail. And from here you see that there's all these designs that you can choose from. So I'm gonna type in work from home. and you get all of these templates, okay? So I'm just gonna choose this one for now, just to show you a few things that you can do. Now, if you go here, you see that this was already inputted in there. What you can do is you can delete that. Okay, now let's go to your uploads and we go to a picture that you would like. Now, I'm just gonna choose this one and you can put it inside that computer which is really cool now of course you don't want to just see my lips <laughs> uh, so we adjust it going down you double click and then you go down and there you go there's my face on a computer now here we do the same thing we can change this title work from home you can change the font however you want if you want a cooler font you know something else if this font isn't what you're looking for then you just go ahead and change that up you have so many options and so many free options here that is pretty much it from here you just go to share you would hit download and then it would go to png so that's what i suggest you download it here you can change the name so if you want to put work from home or youtube template one whatever you want to name it you put that here and you share it and you put it on your computer now those are the two easiest way i told you less than 10 minutes you can do this really quick so don't get discouraged canva is very beginner friendly and it does help you out now if you need more help just hit me in the dms or leave a comment and i'll definitely try to help you if you feel like you need more tips on how to start your youtube channel i'm going to put this playlist on there so go ahead and watch that until next time bye my loves